If you're struggling with sleep and your stress levels are through the roof, you may have too much cortisol, your stress hormone. Here are five simple ways to lower it within the next seven days, inshallah. Number one, either drink bone broth or supplement with magnesium glycinate or glycine. Bone broth naturally contains glycine and magnesium glycinate is really beneficial overall. This is all gonna help you to synthesize GABA, which is a neurotransmitter that helps you to relax. On top of this, you're gonna sleep better, lower your inflammation and clean out some of that digestion. Number two, eat balanced meals, primarily comprised of lean proteins, complex carb with a moderate serving of healthy fat. But more importantly, make sure that you're getting enough fiber, but not too much. This is going to keep your blood sugar stable, which is also going to help your hormones to be more stable and prevent you from spiking your cortisol. When you go through hunger and sugar crashes of unstable blood sugar, that is not good for your hormones or your cortisol, which is why we need the stable blood sugar from the nutrients discussed above. Number three, eat breakfast. You see, intermittent fasting can have some health benefits for certain types of people. But if you're somebody with high cortisol, you're not one of them. You need to make sure that you're getting protein and complex carbs in the morning because in the morning, your cortisol is highest. Now for somebody with normal cortisol, this is fine. This is normal. The cortisol is supposed to go like this throughout the day. If your cortisol is chronically elevated, then we need to do what we can and not just make it worse by fasting in the morning, but instead get the nutrients that your body needs. Number four, get morning sunlight and take daily outdoor walks. Morning sun helps to regulate your circadian rhythm. And even if it's tired, you should still get a little bit of exposure to that natural light outside. When you get your circadian rhythm regulated, it helps you to sleep better and it helps your cortisol to naturally fall better at night, which is how the sleep quality is enhanced. And on top of this, if you live somewhere that's chronically cloudy like the UK, make sure that you supplement with vitamin D. Number five is to retrain your nervous system to actually relax. You need your body to feel safe and calm instead of constantly stressed out. Most people are addicted to stress without even realizing it. If you want to learn how to fix your cortisol and do everything I just said at a much deeper level, just comment cortisol below and I'll send you my free six step guide that goes way deeper into all this. It's literally over an hour long deep dive video. You can listen to it while you're driving. You can watch the whole thing and take notes, whatever mode of consumption works for you to learn this one hour of material that goes way deeper than this video. It's going to help you a lot. It's 100% free, inshallah. So comment cortisol below. I'll send it to you, inshallah. And from there, share it with a friend if you find it beneficial.